There's the border wall. You know, living in South Texas, most of the gap is rural, and then you get down to the urban area, which is the valley. Like, we're low income, we are brown, and we're disproportionately impacted by these anti-choice laws. This used to be the Planned Parenthood, and so when the funding was cut, they turned the Planned Parenthood into an adult daycare center. So it was literally right here, down the street from where I grew up. If you are someone from Brownsville, like my hometown, who needed abortion care, you would have to drive about an hour, an hour and a half to get to the clinic. And that's if you have access to transportation. Like, if I wanted to get an abortion and I was an undocumented woman, I wouldn't have a place to go. Or even me right now as a young person, if I needed an abortion, I wouldn't be able to afford it. Hearing Wendy Davis talking about how a majority of the people that go to the clinics are low-income people of color, and they're really disproportionately impacted by this bill, just showed me, you know, you can't be silent in injustice.